Morning, it's the 10th of uh, December 2021. Got my old mate Long John just outside, he's not allowed him without passport. So, uh, Johnny. Hello, morning. What's the passport? Let me have a look. Here goes, thanks. Thanks. Let me just put over this. Uh, well, look, hang up a minute, John. It's fucking blank. Oh, fucking hell, I forgot to fill it in. Yo, Jesus, come on, let me have this down. Oh, thanks, thanks. How many names have I got? Oh, well, I, I can get them off eBay. Oh, bloody hell, thanks. Oh, uh, ten quid for a thousand. Lots of good. Well, that's got them, we're going to sell. Two stop. pound each, that sells them for. Two pound? Oh. That's not bad. Right, anyway, well, that's got that, I was going to talk about Covid passports, because a few weeks ago we did one, uh, and then they withdrew the fact that we're going to have them. Now they're going to have them again. It's a bit unclear. I think you've got to have them for football, outdoor events over 10,000. You've got to have them for nightclubs. I'm going to have a debate about the mandatory vaccine. I can't believe to take it off, John. All right. Took it off last time. Don't mention vaccines. Oh, sorry. Uh, but while we're talking passports, John, I stole my bloody phone now. Oh, sorry. Right. Phone to a capital F. <laughs> <laughs> While we're, on, while we're on about it, it's a bit unclear. You can have it for crowds, outdoor crowds over 10,000. I don't know who's going to police it all. Nightclubs, indoors, nightclubs. Why don't you have to do it for Meadow Hall or, uh, or Trafford Centre oh, or the, uh, these big shopping centres? Why don't you have to? There's more people there, more people at Meadow Hall. There's people moving about more. Of course, there is. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's the right uh, place with all super spreaders. Go anyway. Well, while well, they've got us talking about this, it's all segregated because there's got people who are pro passport, people who are against passport, such as me and you, John. <laughs> I, hate, I hate the idea of being segregated, but people can't wait to show their passport. I don't know they're going to show it to probably somebody who is less, uh, less intelligent than me, and if there's anybody out there, John. Uh, uh. But I was listening to a phone last night, and I got, a, I got people phoning up saying people who are on, on bikes shouldn't be treated in hospital. I can't, I don't know, I cannot imagine saying that. What, what's a, that's like, what they wanted to say? Yes, yeah, that's exactly it. Uh, what happens if that's paid in? To national well, that's paid in, there's not, 60 there's, years. there's not what happens there. And then they're saying, yeah. because they're intelligent, well, they can't treat Let me tell you, so them people who are unvaxxed start walking around spreading COVID. Uh, there's more people who are being vaccinated spreading than whether they're unvaccinated. Just because you're unvaccinated, don't say you got COVID. I mean, look at me. <laughs> Fit as old. <laughs> But yeah, this is the problem for me, and the problem is testing. If people keep getting tested, this 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 pandemic is never going to end. This virus is never going to go away. You know what? I can suggest, John. Let's no more minute. testing. Let's just forget about it. Let's just one minute. No, no more testing. Yeah, stop testing. You're saying because people say to me, "Oh, Alice has got COVID." Well, how did she know? She's tested. I said, "Why did she test?" I said, "She got a cough." Fucking hell, man! I'll tell you what. What we want is an idiot test, and I'll tell you something, see how many take that, and I'll bet the 45, no, 95% of the population will test positive. Uh, for idiot fucking for, test. For, for, it'll pass the idiot test with flying fucking colours. It boils my piss. <laughs>